Ladies and gentlemen, I'm sure that you know that in the United Kingdom, the biggest UK oil company is called BP, and those initials actually stand for British Petroleum. But did you know that two years ago, BP started rebranding its image, and it began selling itself as BP means beyond petrol. So what they were trying to say was, we are moving into renewable energy. We're going to stop using fossil fuels because that's bad for the environment. We have a completely new concept. Well, the good intentions didn't last very long. BP has uh, since shown that it is not really interested in a gradual phase out of fossil fuels and a move towards renewable energy. On the contrary, it wants to keep producing and processing petrol. In fact, BP is often criticised as one of the most backward-looking oil companies that there is. Yesterday, the environmental reputation of BP, which has already been damaged in the last two years, had another body blow because the UK branch of the WWF, the World Wide Fund for Nature, announced that it was going to sell its shares in BP. The WWF said that BP's activities were no longer compatible with its, that is the WWF's, own socially responsible investment policy. And there's one example in particular that the WWF were not pleased with in BP's activities, and that is their oil and gas operations in Alaska. BP's current operations in Alaska have been criticised for not being safe. There's been a problem with the safety record. And, in fact, BP is also being criticised for its future plans. It's planning to start operations in the Alaskan Nature Reserve, which is obviously a very sensitive area in environmental terms. Now, the WWF only owns 51,000 shares in BP. That's not very many. And, in fact, the value of those shares is only £200,000. Now, this amount is peanuts because the UK's BP is a huge and wealthy company and it has a market value of £25 billion. So we have these shares of 200000 and its market value of £25 billion. It really is nothing at all. However, the WWF has a great deal of global influence. And so the fact that they are selling their shares is very morally and ethically significant. And the WWF is not the only organisation to be selling its BP shares. Another group called the Henderson Global Investors, which is a leading ethical investment fund in the UK, announced also last month that it would be selling its shares because it was no longer confident that BP had a good safety and environmental record in Alaska. All of these criticisms actually have a very good foundation because for example, last year, there were two fatal accidents in Alaska, in BP's plants. And also, uh, the company has refused to exclude drilling in the Arctic Wildlife uh, Reserve. So the criticisms are, in fact, justified. So how will BP react to its WWF sale? Well, yesterday, it said that Quite simply, it had not been informed officially that the WWF was going to sell its shares. And it defended, as well, yesterday, its own safety and environmental record. So I imagine that it will continue to defend its own record and to just brush off these criticisms. But I do think that, undoubtedly, this sale of the shares has been a great embarrassment to the company. Thank you.